Agarose Gel by Institute of Biochemistry and Molecular Biology, National Yumei University. In the following three experiments, including DNA extraction, PCR, and RFLP, electrophoresis will be applied for analysis. Due to the various fragment size of DNA, we fabricate three different concentrations of agarose gels. Add TAE buffer into the serum bottle. As well as agarose powder. We then close the lid and mix thoroughly. Now it is ready to be heated inside the microwave oven. Note that before the heating, the lid ought not to be firmly locked in avoidance of ultra-high pressure in the bottle. The heating process may be subdivided into two to three cycles. If the solid particles were still observed, please heat up again to ensure agarose being completely dissolved. Eventually, we anticipate the solution to be transparent. At the same time, we assemble the gel-making module, which is comprised of the tray and the comb. To increase the thickness of the well button, we lay tiny sheet of paper to heighten the sides. When the solution was cooled down to around 60 degrees Celsius, we pour DNA-safe dye into the agarose solution and mix them well. Finally, the solution was poured into the module. No bubble is welcomed during the process. Do not forget to clean up the cylinders and bottles. Then wait for the gel to solidify and the experiment is accomplished.